It took years and years to get chickens legalized here in Belgrade, but after this November's election, that reality finally came true. I'm proud of what we've done. Mm -hmm. Belgrade is an agricultural community. It was founded on that. I think having a small part of that by having chickens and promoting that heritage is something beautiful. After the November election, 60% of Belgrade voters voted in favor to legalize chickens within city limits and for the sea brasses who have been a part of the movement. It's a huge relief. Yeah, it, there was a question of whether or not it was going to pass. Right now, the city says they have yet to receive applications back, but they say with the winter, it'll be slow and they expect to see more as we get closer to the spring. The seam brasses have also begun their own permit process after they had just finished building their own coop. More material and buy more material and more material and more material. <laughs> So it depends on how elaborate you want to make it. They say the benefits of having their own chickens are... Eggs, which aren't consistent. Chickens don't always lay eggs. Mm -hmm. um, and as we got to meet Scratchy and Pearl, we found a nice surprise. An egg! <laughs> Even though legal chickens are still fairly new to Belgrade, the seabrasses hope to add more to their family. I think we'll see an increase in the spring. A lot of people are waiting for the spring chickens, the mm. little chickies, um, to come out. Residents can now get their permits at City Hall. In Belgrade, Edgar Cedillo, MTN News.